Ricky and I and Andy were in Arizona. We're at a Goodwill and we're gonna start hunting for stuff. First thing we see is we notice this Goodwill has a ton of the big box DVD type sets, which I know Retro Rick is always telling us to be on the lookout for. I immediately spotted this one. Ricky, look at this. Dude, Chucky, really cool. the killer DVD collection for $3.29. This is just super cool, Wait. regardless. Ricky, Indiana Jones. Indiana Jones. Jones. Make sure the discs are in there. Check it, Ricky, check it. Oh yeah, oh yeah, okay. oh yeah. Uh -huh. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh. Uh -huh. oh, oh. Victory is ours. All right, so normally we don't cut in like this, but I am telling you what we're about to find. When Ricky found this, we had zero idea, zero of the value of this thing until way later on. Check this out. What did you just say? It's sealed. Wait, what in the world? Is this like a breast cancer awareness one? Yes. And it's sealed? That? Dude, that's super interesting, Ricky. Wow, I've never I've seen it. I've never seen it. I was like, dude. And I've been, uh, also being an editor for Rick and Caleb, I get to say that I get to see a lot of different things. I got to check out more details on that. Again, so take note on this find. We knew nothing until later that night. I started looking it up and kind of thinking about it. I'm like, I can't find this anywhere. Let me do some research. I text Retro Rick. I text John Riggs. I text Phoenix Resale. A whole bunch of people. Long story short, Retro Rick reaches out to me. He's like, that is extremely friggin' rare. Not only is it extreme friggin' rare, but it's extreme friggin' expensive. Only one available right now for sale online, not even sealed, and Ricky's is sealed, is listed for $1,000. Or you could go with two sealed ones for $5,000. Regardless, holy stinking moly, it's one of the biggest finds we've ever had, and we didn't even know it. And it happened in seconds. They found me a banger. Dora the Explorer. Hey. I don't even think I've seen this. Me neither. No Rick. manual, but the disc is not. Ricky's a hunter, bro. You're the real hunter in this I, household. I just lucked out. I was looking at DVDs. I wasn't even looking for <laughs> <laughs> All right, I was just looking through hats. All I found so far was a eSports gaming hat, which uh, definitely isn't my my cup of tea, if I'm honest. I'm gonna buy this one for my wife. Aww. I totally know she'll dig this style, like the worn denim and walk by faith. That's kind of our jam. All right, Ricky, don't move. Yay! You moved, but I'll accept it. <laughs> There's a lot of toys here kind of spread out, but I haven't seen any good ones. Here's a newer TMNT van right there. Ricky, I know you want this, man, for you. There you go, my little Ricky. All right, Ricky. Ooh, I was looking at this little Star Wars thing right here. I think it's like a little laptop, Ricky. But you found Superman, Superman characters. Superman. Character. There's like the Domo character, like the Funko style one. How much is the bag? I mean, it might be worth grabbing. Plus, she's a pretty dope. Look, someone already grabbed something from it. Oh, look at this. No, he's doll. Look at this. Oh, he's, he's sagging. sagging a little bit. Sagging. See this right here? Yes, this was actually a self defense mechanism. <laughs> <laughs> just found a really cool item in the electronics a gm good wrench cell phone i feel like this is such a cool little niche of old school stuff remember like old when phones used oh, to be yeah. like take the place of like Always. products i don't think this came with like any sort of like stand or wall mount or something i think it was just like this you know i mean come on for any little kid you invite your friends over and you're like hold on let me <laughs> up next is this pokemon stick t-shirt i'm gonna pick this up for sure did it go in Oh, dang it. No. Dude, that just lost all its value. What is it, Ricky? MTV sweater. I see the shirts, but I never see the sweaters. Remember when MTV, like, played music? Wait, MTV does music? All right, some really good scores at Goodwill. We're going to go to Bookman's next, but first... Let us quickly show you guys what we got. All right, for me, I got this hat for my wife, Pokemon shirt, MLB The Show t-shirt, NASA t-shirt, super sick vintage telephone right here, and this Chucky DVD set right here, my favorite things. Oh, and this Hobbit one, by the way, Bolo right here, this sells for about $30 and it was only $3. Ricky, on the other hand, got this, which we cannot find online sealed like this. Have not seen it. We've seen it without the sleeve, without like the cancer awareness. So very interesting. I messaged Caleb about this. He got Dora on the GameCube. Big, uh, this one's really cool, by the way, a Dr. Dre t-shirt. I'm skipping through these quick because Ricky's real come up was this t-shirt that apparently goes for what? I think like 85 bucks, 90? You know what mile? you could do with $85, Andy? Spend it. And then he got some other shirt. Oh, this is a cool one. And this is like, what, a $20 shirt also? Yeah. How much does this go for online? 80 bucks. Are you buying it to keep it or sell it? <laughs> sell it. Up next is Bookman's, which I have not been here and no joke, probably like five 
ish years, maybe longer. They got the games. Ricky's down here looking at Game Boy games. Also, we were looking at this Persona Q. 320 isn't that bad. It sells for like 380 online as well. But... I like that foot clan. It's only 14 bucks. All the foot clan, dude. So check it out. They do have the Nintendo World of Nintendo cabinets, but they do not have any of the, the signs that go up here with it. But Ricky's over here looking at games. Switch for 300. Dreamcast controller for 40. Got lots of amiibos down here. I am curious on these plushies, Ricky. Got a lot of strategy guides here. Ricky's looking at a top secret. That's so sick. I mean, actually, this girl, you could probably ask her the price. Look at this one, Ricky. Ready? Ooh, that's actually the legendary world of Zelda. The that ultimate. One price? Oh, that oh, one does have a price. price. Oh, that's sick. Partners in time. Oh, Ricky, here we go. That's what I'm talking about. Hello. Small Soldiers Electronic Pinball Game. Super cool, still in the box. You don't find these in the box ever. See them loose here and there, but I've never seen it in the box ever. Small Soldiers, I love it. And actually, 10 bucks, that's actually a really good price. All right, we are out of Bookman's, but what we didn't mention, and we didn't even know, there was a Goodwill literally next door to this Bookman, so you know we're gonna go into Goodwill and check out what they have. So hopefully we can find some more good stuff because in the last Goodwill, we did really good for a really short amount of time. So Andy pulled this out, and as soon as he pulled it out, he was looking at it because it's actually one of the best movies ever, to be honest. But as soon as he pulled it out, I was like, hey, just so you know, I think that's a valuable DVD. Do you not want that? He's like, no, I don't care. This recently just sold for about $37, but it's a fantastic DVD. Legit one of the best. It's called a win-win. I think it's called a win-win. <laughs> Ricky, Andy, Berenstein or Berenstein? Berenstein Bears. Andy, Ricky? Berenstein. What is it, Ricky? Oh, wow. Oh, Laura Croft over there. Take it easy. Wow. All right, check this out. Look, you put it in there, and you can just sit there and like watch it. This is like every kid I see in current 22. Parents, please stop letting your children be on their phone so much. This is what basically I see every kid during the day. Good old Ricky. Wow, Ricky. Something is not right here. What happened? You see it? No, it's arms broken. It's not broken. It's just, I mean, if you can find it, it's gone. gone. Oh, it's just gone. It's gone. Dude, it's like, got to be here somewhere. Kratos, where's Kratos. thy arm? I just found this is kind of cool. Look, Mickey. it's actually vintage though. Yes. I like that. It's a vintage Walt Disney, Disney World, World Cup. Yeah. It is cool display regardless. You could always do what I do. Like when your stuff's broken, put it in the front and put like random things in front of it where you don't even see it. You know? True, actually. Like, eh, whatever. Just was digging through the hats and I found this hat. I don't even know what it is. LA Eureka or La Eureka, but I love the style of it. I love the color and I love myself some strap backs that are easy to just toss on, so. Hello, neighbor. Hello, shopping cart. What's this? What's this? What's this? Actually, no, Ricky, for real though, what is this? From behind. Oh, oh, audio. Oh, is that a, no, it's just this. Is that battle for it? Yes. Nothing worse than when you just want one of them in the bag and they're both side by side. Come on, see, and I'm too nice of a human to rip them out and ask for separate. Ricky, cut. Is that the real Tickle Me Elmo? Is that the actual Tickle Me Elmo? Looks like it actually chomps though, look. Uh, it's Luigi time. Uh, <laughs> I got one. <laughs> I got it. I'm stoked to get Luigi though for a buck fifty. That's a great deal. Oh yeah. Oh. Some Mario Kart sheets. Yeah? Is that the complete set, Ricky? That's hilarious. These are pillowcases. Wow, these have got to be different though. These are different style. How interesting, Ricky. This is just a Mario. Everyone here likes to sleep with Mario. Ricky is saying, dude. What is it? What is it? Show me. <laughs> Ricky, that was stupid and a waste of three seconds. Woo! I found this though. Woo! That's pretty cool. Now that's much cooler to be honest. Look, it's like the, you know the Mega Man one? Yeah. Dude. Ricky. Gildan? Gildan. With us. It's a small, so it won't fit me definitely. But a small person definitely will. What did you end up walking out with? I walked out with his Mario tee and this Godzilla tee. Sick. Nothing like that, but pretty dope. I walked out with this Walt Disney World mug, which by the way, in case you are wondering, it's like an $18 mug, this hat for myself to wear. And he found me this Dr. Pepper cup because this is like my kind of cup. I drink out of these every day. And Luigi. Oh. Everybody say goodbye. Goodbye. For Mr. <laughs>